Good morning friends. I hope everyone is doing well and I request everyone to go through the videos in a sequence for better understanding. Okay, so let me discuss another example for constructing the minimum DFA. So let me read out the question. Construct a minimal DFA over alphabets A comma B for a long wise L1 contains even length strings. The length of the string should be even. So what is meant by even length strings? It should be zero. Length should be 2 or length should be 4, length should be 6, length should be 8, so on. Okay, so we will check what are the strings belongs to long ways L1. Now, everyone know what is the string whose length is 0 is epsilon. Okay, of length 2 is AB, BA, BB, okay, then BA. These are the strings of length 2. Length 4, you have to write it. It will take a lot of time, so I will not write what are the strings of length 4. Then length 6, length 8, so on. So whether it is a finite long base or infinite long base? It is an infinite long base. If it is an infinite long base, there may be a DFA or there may not be a DFA. So for this infinite long base, we will check whether there is a DFA is possible or not. If it is possible, what is the DFA? Okay, so now we will see, as I said earlier, if you have an epsilon, then initial state will act as a final state because when I can say that any string is accepted by the DFA from the initial state, after reading the entire string, you should go to the final state. Now, epsilon is nothing but empty string. So, from initial state, Without reading anything, you should go to the final state. How you can go? If initial state itself is a final state, then I can say that epsilon is accepted. Now we will see the next one. A, B, whether it should be accepted. No, it should not be accepted because it will become as a length 1. Why I am writing A, comma B? Because it can come A or it can come B. Is it clear? That's why I am writing it as A, comma B. If it is A, we should not accept or if it is B, we should not accept. Why? The length of the string will be 1. If it is length 2, then I should accept. Is it clear? Let me take an example. A, B. A, B should be accepted or not? It should accept because it is belongs to long base L1. So, we will check it. Q0 on A, where I am going? I am going to state called Q1. From Q1, where I am going, a state called Q0. Whether Q0 is a final state? Yes, Q0 is a final state. If Q0 is a final state, what I can say? The given string AB is accepted by the DFA. And it is belongs to long base L1. So I can say that this is correct DFA. We will see AAB. AAB, what is the length of the string? Is 3. Because you have 3 alphabets. So I can say that the length of the string is 3. Now, whether this string belongs to long base L1? No. Because length 3 is an odd length. But in the given question, they said even length string. So it does not belong to long base L1. If does not belong to long base L1, what my DFA should do? It should not accept. So we will check it. Whether it is accepting or not accepting. From an initial state Q0, on A, I am going to a state called Q1. From Q1 on A, I am going to Q0. Q0 on B, Q0 on B, I am going to a state called Q1. Is it clear? From Q0 on A, I came to Q1. Q1 on A, I went to Q0. Q0 on B, I came to Q1. Whether Q1 is a final state? No, it is not a final state. Or I can say that it is a non-final state. Once you reach a non-final state after traversing the entire string, I can say that the string was not accepted by this DFA. So, if you see that the strings which belongs to long base L1 will be accepted by the DFA and the strings which does not belong to this long base L1 will not be accepted by the DFA. So, I can say that this is the correct DFA for the given question. See, it is the minimal DFA. Are you able to understand? If you want the DFAs, you can find the n number of DFAs. But I am constructing the minimum DFA. So for a given question, you will have only one DFA. 
one minimal DFA. So that's why I am discussing for you. So I hope you have understood this concept. If you have not understood the concept, don't worry. I will teach few more questions so that you will understand. Thank you so much.